Welcome to Scribble Maps. In this quick video, we're going to cover how to make your first custom map. You have so many options to choose from, but let's start with the draw tool. This gives you the freedom to scribble or sketch on the map. Once you're satisfied with your map, it's time to save it. Click on the menu button at the top left of the screen. Then click on Save Map. In the Save Map dialog box, you will find your map ID. This is your map's custom, randomly generated, case-sensitive ID. You can create your own ID just as long as no one else is using it. To make changes to a map or another user's map, you need the map password. You can assign a password to your map here. Add a title and description to your Scribble map here. You have three options to save your map. The default for a basic account is a public Scribble map. A private map is an unlisted map that doesn't appear in our public map directory. And a secure map is unlisted and is password protected. These advanced features require an account upgrade. Click autosave so that you don't lose any progress on your map as you work on it. When you're ready, click on save map. Autosaving does not begin until the map is saved for the first time. This will take you to the Map Save dialog box. Here you'll find your map ID, share and edit links, as well as a download image link of your custom map for your blog. As an upgraded user, you can save a high resolution image of your saved map. You can also save your Scribble map as a downloadable PDF, share it with your friends and colleagues through Facebook. You can order a high resolution poster print of your map, email your Scribble map to a friend, as well as embed a Scribble map widget onto your website for an interactive view of your map. Once you're ready, you can click the Continue Working button and resume working, or exit Scribble Maps. It's that easy to get started. 